Today I am playing Death Smiles for the Xbox 360. Let's get this started. It's a horizontal shmup by Cave. And we're gonna get it going now. We pick three different path paths here. Let's start this way, I guess. I don't know. I'd like to see all the different paths as we go, eventually. So you can fire in both directions. Um, depending on what button you hit, that's what turns the, uh, the direction of the shot. So basically I'm doing a B, B button to fire the right and A button to fire the left. As you can see, it's a horror-themed thing here. Got some the spooky guys. There's different characters you can be. I, I picked the one with the owl. I like, I, I dig the owl. There's another one that has like a bat, and another one that has a uh, dragon. Pretty cool. I like how Halloween-themed the game something that kind of makes it stand out. I guess uh, Cotton can be like that too. Cotton's got that like, sort of horror theme going on. Then there's, an, uh, there's another uh, one I can think of that's a horror, horror theme shmup. There's Undead Lion for Mega Drive. Look at this, look at this. <laughs> That's awesome. Look at the pumpkins, I love it. Boom. Boom. What's up, Derb86 and I am Demon84, Josh Philly Boy, and Cryptic Monster? So yeah, again, this is uh, by Cave. They made lots of, you know, sh shooters, shmups. Um, and what I like in particular the most about this game is I can pronounce it. <laughs> Unlike most of their games. What's up, Friggle D? Riker loves to play play the bone. <laughs> Yes, the trombone. We got lots of bones on the stage here. Now we're in a graveyard. This is cool. I like the, uh, you know, atmosphere. Now I'm curious what the boss will be. The Frankenstein's monster or something. And one thing I gotta mention, so I am playing this on a, the uh, American Xbox 360, even though I do have the, uh, oh no, I'm sorry, I'm, no I'm not, I'm playing this on the uh, Japanese Xbox 360. I have two different versions of the game, <laughs> uh, it, depending on whatever that, I think it's pretty much the same. But um, what I was going to say is I got a controller. We all know how, about how the D-pad on the 360 controller is, is crappy, right? Um, but I got another controller for Xbox 360. Oh, my God, look at this. Oh, my, you know what? It is kind of, it's like Frankenstein Monster's face. But basically, I'm going to show, show you the controller I, I, I have, which I, I really like it so far. And the, po the other point I was going to make is that the controller, I tried it on both. It works on the American console and it works on the uh, Japanese console. Let's use the bomb there. Boom. Ooh, look at all, this, look at all those goodies. Uh, so this is the controller I have here. It's a Hori Fighting Commander 
that's the controller there. And I actually really like it. So, it's a good, at least so far, it's a good D-pad. So that's what I've been using. Thank you, Photon Earth, for the sub, and thank you again, Josh Philly Boy, for 25 months. You got the Elite controller. I do, but I don't believe that the Elite controller works on the 360. See, this is on 360, because that works on Xbox like One and beyond, and I use that on my PC and stuff. But for 360, I don't, I don't, I think I tried it once and I think it didn't work. So I don't think that works on the 360. If it does and I'm wrong, please let me know. Because that's probably, that's what I would be using probably. But actually, I'll tell you what though, this controller is really good, really good too. So I don't even mind. And like with most of these games, uh, that are sort of the, Got sort of the bullet hell thing going on. Your the little yellow dot on her is actually your hitbox. So it's not the whole character. So when you see bullets passing through this character, like the legs and whatnot, the hitbox is not the whole character. It's only the little the little dot in the center there. You know, for you guys that are unfamiliar with this sort of genre of game. Fucker. Boom. Oh shit. Oh, let's collect all this stuff. Get it, get it, get it. Alright. I don't really know what I'm doing, so. Thank you, Lancinator, for the sub. He's playing Ori and the Will of Wisps. I'm wondering if I played Ori before. Yeah, we did a video on uh, Ori and the Blind Forest, I believe the original one was called. I played that one a bit. And I remember liking it. I liked the art style. Thank you, Brisby, for 33 months of subbing. But can you use the 360 controller with the Activision Atari collection? <laughs> right? Atari collection. I think so. I think my shot is more powerful now. I don't know exactly, but I think there's something like when you get to a thousand points, then you can sort of activate a stronger shot. See how that's in the bottom left there? How the points are going down there? I think when that runs out, it'll stop. Because like right, I, I assume that's what it is. I think right now I'm more powerful or something. I'm not entirely sure. Now it's, it's about to run out. There, just ran out, and now I start, and now I collect again. And as I get all that, all these little treasures, now I'm collecting again. Probably a good idea to save all that stuff for the boss, right? Ooh, almost got hit there. And another crazy thing is, there is actually, a, you get a bit of an energy bar where some of these games don't even give you that, so. That's a little forgiving, the fact that you got a good energy bar. And there's difficulty settings. I'm on an easier difficulty setting right now, as I'm just getting used to this. Now, I've heard some rumors, or read somewhere, that I think they're going to be releasing this game eventually on Switch, if it's not already out. So, we'll see if that happens. Definitely the Japanese version of the game. So I showed the wrong cover, so hold up a second. So, wait a second, let me grab the... Oh, here it is here. So this is the actual one I'm playing. Not that you can see it like that here. Is this gonna work? Nope. Uh, well, I could do this. There you go. There, this is the version of, of the game I'm playing, and then this is the American one that I'm not playing right now. My 
stuff is like not set up right right now. Got to fix that. Fix it later. Shooting pots at me? Okay. Nice. Gotcha. Both games are getting re released. Yeah, that's what I was just saying. Switch and like PS4 and stuff, right? You're finishing up a 14 hour Mega Man 1 through 6 speed run and you're aiming for sub 15 hour. Okay, I don't know anything about speed running, but good luck on that. This one's Halloween themed and the sequel is Christmas themed. Yeah, I have a Death Miles too as well. Hopefully one day they'll do a Death Smiles 3, we get Cave back together, and uh, Death Smiles 3 could be focused all around Arbor Day. Maybe uh, Thanksgiving. I don't know. i just throw in all the rest of the holidays. We'll do Easter. So now I've got the thousand, which I guess I activate. Okay. I guess I, I you hit both buttons at once or something. So I, it's activated now. Look at all this shit I'm getting. video game boss I've ever seen right there. I think there should be more video game bosses that are just like, just like, like I have a big goat or something. I have a big fucking cow. <laughs> you know? It's like, it's like, we had, we had like a Grim Reaper. We had like a creepy tree. Now we're just gonna have like a cow or whatever the fuck. Cave's making another mobile game, so doubt it. Oh, are they still doing stuff? I didn't even know. They're doing mobile stuff now? That's too bad. Thank you, Dark Fielder, for subbing Tier 1. Appreciate that very much. <laughs> Super Jeff goes, move it. <laughs> Groovy. Looks like we're in hell now. Castlevania like as they would. I like the little bu butcher pigs. You butchered the pig, now they're gonna butcher you. Speaking of cave games and uh, pigs, there is a cave game called uh, Mushy Mushy Pork. I also want to try that out as well. Another 360. A lot of these games are 360, but they uh, have, you know, ports on, like, PlayStation and Saturn and 
uh, of a lot of different cave games. PS2. This is pretty awesome, though. I, uh, also, I believe this game is on Steam. I don't really know how the Steam ports of this are. No, no idea. But uh, but I like this. Oh, boom! That's right. That's right. You're going down. Strike Witches is the mobile shmup game. Is that what it's called? Strike Strike Witches? Should look that up. Is that the cave? I like this map. That reminds me of Castlevania too a little bit. Strike Witches. Special DLC lets you fight pink sweet bosses. The DLC for the mobile game, you mean? Uh, Akai Dezu? I'm sorry, I'm probably mispronouncing your name completely. Just like I mispronounced the name of all these games. <laughs> and I'll gradually, uh, we'll gradually up the difficulty. It's on an easier setting right now. I'm just kind of, we're just checking it out right now. Uchi Muchi Pork has special DLC. Does it? Interesting. Okay, I haven't even popped that in yet, so. Right, if I did, it was a while ago. I don't, I don't really remember. So yeah, I have not bothered to really mess with that one much. I, all I know is just that I, I look at it's got the pigs on it or whatever. I don't I don't know anything about it yet. I'm still learning about all this shit. I did a whole stream on uh, the uh, Mushi Hai Misama Futari one. That that was a fun game. I like that one quite a bit. I actually like to try out the original one too. Whoa. That last dude looked like the fucking guy on level two of Ghosts and Goblins. I'm almost out of life here. Oh shit. Alright, there goes my continue. Boom. That guy right there. This dude, Cyclops. Whoa. I'm about to get fucked up. Oh, here, <laughs> here, here, see it, him again. This is my favorite part. different characters. Uh-oh. Oh, damn it! Come on, I just used it. Nice. 
I'm in trouble. I'm just gonna use it. Alright, I got my thousand. No idea what this final boss is gonna be. I don't remember. Oh my god. Oh, I'm out of fucking bombs. That would be a good place to save it for. Shit. All over the place now. This is nuts. I like this level. It should be Dracula at this point, right? I mean, it's like this it seems like it's Dracula's castle. Shit. I'll be very happy if we fight a vampire at the end, I think. It would seem fitting. Two on the screen at once here. Get him! Here, I hear the church bells ringing. Is this gonna be it? Ooh. Ha! Like the haunted mansion. This is cool. <sighs> Gotta swap these controls around a little bit. this fucking guy. Yeah, no. Missing all those treasures. Whew. Now what? Oh my god. Oh, here we go. I guess. A warlock, a wizard, or something? I don't know. What do we got? It's like a, 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 a villager that's going after Frankenstein. I guess he's like a warlock or something. Okay. Ain't no big deal. Ah! It sounds like uh, fucking Ganondorf, like when you're fighting Ganondorf in Ocarina at a time, and you, you, you hit the fucking thing back and forth, <laughs> you know? It's the exact same sound effect, I swear to God. I should do a comparison. Final boss of Death Smiles compared to final final boss of Ocarina of Time. <laughs> Sound effect. It's very similar. Oh, give me all the treasures. Alright. Probably resets my score when I fucking use a continue, right? So, it sucks, but whatever. Take him to hell. That looks like the fucking thing from Beetlejuice, that face. What the fuck? Oh, we're not done! Oh! Oh ho oh, oh. ho! Okay, I thought that was the fucking end of the game. Okay. Shit just got real. I didn't know. I didn't know. Wow. Oh, 
I'm fucked. Yeah. Yep. So you gotta hit the heart, right? Maybe? I guess? I don't know. No idea. I have no fucking idea. I'm just making assumptions. Oh! Oh, shit. Yeah, boom. You don't like that, do you? Oh, f well, I can't shoot up. Wait, what? Now, I don't even know what to do. Fuck. I gotta get up high like this? I, don't, I have no idea. Maybe, maybe you're supposed to hit the hands now. Shit. No fucking idea what's happening. if I'm doing this right. Oh my god. Oh, he just came out? The fuck? This is gnarly as shit. Gimme, 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 all the stuff. That's gotta be it. That was it. Holy shit. Now, yeah, I guess that was it. Oh my god! Well, that was cool. I dig it. <laughs> it's the heart, it was the heart. I don't know, the, I guess the, the part where the hands come down, you're supposed to just hit the hands. Thank you, Hey Hey Allen, for the tier one sub and Mike Cade classic, or classic Mike Cade, I should say. That bastard was shooting giant black light colored sperm at you. Don't you hate when that happens? Crazy Swayze. It's always a problem. Foob says he can't decide if he really loves or hates the graphics. They're they're kind of like varied, aren't they? Um, I thought the like the final bosses and the stage look cool. Uh, our red right hand asks, "What do you ask for at the barber when you go?" Uh, usually, I just ask uh, to uh, to not have my head cut off. I'm like, if you could not. Uh, cut my head off or, or you know slip my throat that would be great and they're like hmm to try and then I'm just sweating bullets the entire time so usually that usually just no, no decapitation is what I say if you're looking to know the exact terminology of what I say so let's see all right oh cool you can you can skip all that Cool. All right. Well, that was that was on easy. So let's uh, ramp it up here. Oops. Deleted it. I can't. I can't read the font. So what do you want from me? All right. So let's see if we can. Sure. Let's save it over that. Let's see if we can crank up the difficulty some here. Maybe. Maybe we can do that. Let's do, let's drop it down. All right, life down one, difficulty up one. That's, that's enough for now. Let's make sure that's saved. Yeah, okay. And we'll gradually, gradually up it. That's what we'll do. Can I play Nintendogs? <laughs> maybe, maybe sometime. I've been playing Advance Wars quite a bit off stream. Very fun. Wait, you missed the entire game by getting here a half hour late? 
so this is a lot of these shmups are like you know only several stages and you play through them again and again and again uh, a lot of people play these to go for the high score i don't really i'm not looking to break any records here i'm just having fun playing them um but uh so i just played through on an easier setting now i'm gonna gradually ramp it up a bit more more of my goals um you know i'm not a person that really goes for like high scores with this stuff or anything but uh this would be the type of game be cool like to try to do it without dying let's say like i would try to do that maybe or at the least like try to get through it on like one continue like that would be a goal that i would do i don't, I don't try to get like world high scores or anything like that Mike, are there any consoles that you don't own, says Guts Taijo. Uh, there is. It's mostly, like, real obscure shit. Um, uh, off the top of my head, I don't know. Uh, I do have a list of a few consoles that I don't have, but it's, uh, it's mostly pretty obscure s stuff. So... All right. Every death is a reset. Well, eventually, if I got, eventually got good at it enough, you know. So I have noticed a little bit of lag here and there with it. It's not bad, but there's a little bit. Especially, it seems to be when you load between areas. Like like when I'm playing the actual game, there doesn't really seem to be any lag. But when uh, when I like beat a boss and then it loads to the next area, it seems like there's a little bit of lag there. So this game's apparently coming out on uh, PS4 and Switch. I would hope that they uh, fix that. Because this version that I'm playing now probably came out 10 years ago or something. In the olden days, in like 2010 or something. Actually, when did the, this come out? Let's see if it says it right here. There's a date on there. I think it's like I think it was like 2010. Actually, don't see. Oh, 2007. I guess 2007. I guess. I don't know. I don't know if that was one, the arcade one or the or of the port of it. Arcade version was 27, but the port's from 2010. Oh, okay. That's yeah. I thought so. All right, so, well, I got through level one without dying, right? So that's something. Let's see if we can get through level two without dying. And I, dry, I dropped my life bar down a little bit, too, as well. Because I guess you, the max you can do is five bars of health. And I don't know what the least is. Probably... Maybe it's two or three or something. And gradually make it harder on myself. It's cool how you can blow up the buildings like that. His face is fucking creepy as shit. Jordan? <laughs> what the fuck? It's 
it's as good a place as any, I say. I don't know, like, that's another thing, you know, to learn what would be all the best places to use the bombs and whatnot. And I, I don't even know if you get extra bombs either. Maybe you do. But, that looks like I got through the first two levels without dying, so cool. Good, good, good. See, like, right there? That's where it does the little jitteries. Twenty ten is just the release date for the poor is out in Japan in two thousand nine. Oh, okay, well so the then two thousand and nine then is the version that I'm playing. Was it Christopher Lloyd? Yes. I think it was Christopher Lloyd for sure. Speaking of, uh, so somebody was talking about consoles that I don't have. I mean, I don't have like every like version of every console. Um, like, uh, for example, like the MSX. I have an MSX, but I have the MSX2 Plus. That's the version I have. Like, I don't have like the first MSX, I guess. So there's like stuff like that. Like, I don't have all the versions of each system. I like, but I think I think I have every model of the PlayStation 3. I have a lot of PlayStation 3s for some reason. <laughs> I also have a lot of PS2s. Is that like a Japanese modded one? Um, PAL one, you know, there's like all that too. And then there's like different color variations. Of, like, so it's like, like, like with the GameCube, I think I have all the different color GameCubes. Like maybe there's one I don't have, but um, I think I think I have all the different colors. I like the orange one the best. Audio coming from the TV speakers. It is, yes. If there's a mod in here, you can link them to my blog, which explains my audio. I don't like to wear. I don't wear headphones. I don't like wearing headphones. Sometimes when I when I do like video editing, um, I'll pop in headphones briefly just to check. Uh, to check the sound in headphones, but I really hate wearing headphones, so I don't. Um, there's there's a there's a list of reasons why I don't do direct capture. I kept thinking I could smash into that. Oh shit! Background there. Or that I got hit there, so I think that was the first time I got hit, actually. Shit. I like the sort of background scrolling in like that, it's kind of cool too. Thank you, Brisby. Yeah, so check out that link Brisby, Brisby put there. You like headphones, but they don't like you. Anyone ever trip over the cord and wreck them? 
No, it's not. Yeah, I don't have a problem with the cord really. I just I don't I don't like. Them. I just don't like them. Boom. All right, so far so good. Are there any systems or games that would be your personal holy grail? Uh, as far as systems, I, I at this point I think I have most of the systems I really want. Honestly, um, maybe maybe there's something I don't know. But uh, with games, sure, there's a lot of games that that I want. Yeah. There's always more games. <laughs> Mary. Mary, Mary, quite contrary. That's where I let my chat finish the rest. Yeah. Boom. Boom. Death Smiles. Yes, this is Death Smiles. That boss is playable in the black label, by the way. She just bites herself. The Sega Pico is all you need. We, I have a Sega Pico sitting right over there. <laughs> Thank you, Nikki. So yeah, this game is horror Halloween themed, which is very cool. I like that about it. I actually say it's more it's more Halloween than, than horror. There's lots of pumpkins and sort of that uh, difference between ho hor just horror and Halloween, I guess. You know, when you have like lots of jack-o'-lanterns and stuff like that, and it starts to get like witches, that's gets a little bit, bit more like Halloween. Those, those things are cool. And it, like it, there's certain things that you like you only see I think in certain levels here like that frog guy I think that was the only part of the game to see that I, I think I keep forgetting I have this thousand like I can use are we going to fight the devil Here it goes. Boom. 
All right. I have still not died, but I got hit a few times. Gradually taking away that energy. How about a death smiles, no hit run? <laughs> Eventually you do the hardest setting. Not even no death, but do no hit, right? Not usually a horror, <laughs> not usually a horizontal shmup fan, but make an exception for this one. You can usually expect game to be good. Yeah, no, I like horizontal shmups. I like uh, a lot, a lot of them. I mean, I like uh, one of my favorites is Gradius Five. I like them both. I like, I like, I like vertical shmups. I like horizontal shmups, and I, I like Bullet Hell stuff. I like, I like all of it. Now there's certain games that I don't like. Uh, I don't like Ray Zamber at all. <laughs> um, there, there's definitely some schmups that I don't like, but uh, but I like all the different genres. Like each each of the sort of types of schmup, uh, there are games of each that I that I like. I'm personally still waiting for to see the uh, Sesame Street shmup. I don't know when they're going to make it, but I'm, I'm still holding my breath on that. It'd be Elmo flying around in a spaceship, shooting volleys of laser beams and whatnot. The final boss of the game, I think, would have to be Snuffleupagus and the trunk would be like, sort of like hentai tentacles. That's what I'd like to see anyhow. <laughs> That's just me though. because my life's low, and I have them all. Ha <laughs> there he is. Like he comes back. He's like, I'm not done yet, motherfucker. My, my no death is coming to a quick close here. In a moment. Which is not even what I'm trying to do, by the way. It's getting a little wild now. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit. I'm actually very glad that I used that there. Oh no. 
ran right into him. Son of a bitch, son of a bitch. All right. Come on. Oh, that money. <laughs> Whatever it is, treasure, I don't fucking know what it is. I'm calling it money. Billions of dollars. Oh, you motherfucker. This shit, I forgot about this. I gotta get better grabbing that shit at the edge of each one of these things. Oh, God. There, like, there, that's a little better. Oh, my lord. Oh, my lanta. Oh, no. There's still three bombs. He's gonna get them. goodies <laughs> thank you phoenix f2b for that sub oh gifting a sub to dan versus donuts thanks gino is it the disney haunted mansion stage that's what i said earlier i bet they were thinking that you know Sure, what you do on this part, really? 
Maybe we're just supposed to like wait these things out. I don't know. Fucking hilarious. Yeah! Watch out for my pink sperm. dance like that at the end. That's the most important part. <laughs> You've done one CC in this game and you don't know how to fight the boss. <laughs> oh, the final boss. Ah, I mean, I don't know. This is my first time ever seeing the whole game, so I have no fucking clue. Your strategy for this boss is basically just spam the bomb. That seems to be a good strategy. <laughs> boom. That's the strategy is boom. Yeah, it's cool, Briscoe. Is it a witchy? It there are lots of witches. Witch night. There are lots of witches in this game. Cool, cool, cool. All right, so we did two little run-throughs of this here. Sure, save it over this, I guess. I don't know. And so let's go back to the options here. So I've been gradually upping this. So we got... Uh, we're gonna do three lives now. Difficulty, ramp it up a little bit more. And I guess is this giving me uh, continues? I suppose. I'm assuming that's what that is. Not that I can read that. So let's pull that off. And see see how not far I can get now. <laughs> No Donatello. Oh, yeah, this is a no Donatello run, by the way. Let's, uh, I don't know what one to do. Maybe this one. I, you think I turned off my special move or my bomb? I turned off the bomb? Well, I guess we'll, we'll find out really quickly. I didn't mean to do that if that's what I did. I thought maybe that was continues. Let's see. No, there's bombs. Well, we'll see in a moment. That'd be like a super challenge.
Whoa. God. Oh my god. Yeah, see my life bar now? Now I have like. Now we're down to three. Assuming that's as low as it goes. He could have been, they could have put a big smile on his face and he could have been the death smile. I mean, he is kind of smiling. He had so many crowns in his pocket. Where did he buy all those crowns? He looks pretty happy to you. He died laughing. <laughs> Thank you, Phoenix, for gifting the sub. The mag was, uh, crowns are us. Ske LOL, skeletons always look like they smile because they have no skin. You know what? That's a good point. I guess, <laughs> I guess that's true. They're in a constant state of smiling. No wonder skeletons are so appealing. They've always got that happy face on. If I'm ever having a real bad day where I feel like I'm in a bad mood, I should just rip my face off. Then I'll be smiling. That's probably the best way to go about it, I think. If you're not having a bad day, just tear your own face off. Everybody will look at you and say, boy, you, you look happy today. I sure am! <laughs> fucking Skeletor. Skullmageddon. Here he is. Here he is. Much they drew first blood. Do I like Lipton iced tea? Uh, not like particularly. Um, I would I drink it I guess. But it's not like the first thing I choose. Why? <laughs> Mike, I have a burning desire question for you. I need to know right now if you like Lipton, Lipton iced tea. Um, I, I can tell you, I, I do not, uh, nor have I ever really liked Mountain Dew. I don't really care for Mountain Dew. Never did. Not a huge fan of Shasta. Sorry, Shasta fans. I'm, I'm just kidding, actually. All I drink is Shasta. Diet Shasta. Mmm, that's the way. I've actually never had another drink besides Diet Shasta. I live on Diet Shasta, actually. Ever since birth, 
<laughs> nothing, nothing but Diet Shasta. <laughs> This is God intended. The fuck was that? Like smiley face that came out of that tree? Did you see that up there? This game's fucking crazy. It's crazy shit. Suckled on that diet shasta. That's right. That was a giant apple. You're not making it up. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's cool. It's like the fucking Wizard of Oz, where the, the trees are throwing the apples or whatever. All right, I'm going to take a quick break, and we'll be right back. Is that an emote? Because that's my break animation. It's to be used when my break animation pops up. <coughs> One thing I didn't mention, um, I believe this game has different modes to it as well, which I can get through the main menu. The main menu... I'm not really sure what the differences are with the modes. Probably, I'd imagine scoring is probably different or something. But I'm not keeping track of scoring, so probably doesn't matter to me. I don't know. I don't know if the gameplay at all is different or anything. Um, so I really have no idea. But there are different modes. Nine sixty nine, guys, check it out. Nine sixty nine. Oh, and it's gone. So sorry. I know you're upset about it. I'd like to be able to drop my familiar down below. Use that fucking owl like a uh, mini mouse <laughs> so that it doesn't get hit by the projectiles. It's always like the first example I use of that because that was probably the first time I had a character like that, I guess, from being a kid. Mini mouse. <laughs> Reminds you of Cotton on Mega Drive? Yes, indeed. Real quick, uh, there's a fourth difficulty level called level 999. Okay, yeah, I, I don't know. You, you can tell me, I, I don't know. You know more than I do, probably. And here's a witch right here. I'm sorry to say, I'll be putting her, putting her away shortly. Oh, she's throwing pots at me. How dare she? What do you think I am, Link? How am I going to contend with all these pots? Wow! Am I playing this with my ball sack? I am. Um, usually I play, my, play games with uh, my ball sack. Um, 
it makes it a different experience probably than a lot of people that play shmups. Uh, some people like to use different, you know, arcade sticks or um, different types of controllers. Uh, I used to only play shmups exclusively with uh, the Wii, the Wii nunchuck, not the Wii mode itself, but just the nunchuck. Um, but yeah, since then I've I've transitioned to playing these games with my ball sack, and um, I, I feel like it's go it, it's 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 probably the the best controls that I've found so far. Although I know Hori makes really good controllers. There's those uh, uh, Ape Do, like that. What is it like the SN Plus and all that stuff? So it just depends what kind of controller you prefer. The NES van advantage is, is cool. Whatever, whatever you like. And gone. Moo. Whatever that is, like an ox, I guess. I don't fucking even know. That's how I'm so good. I use the ball sack method. I mean, it makes it easier. Uh, I used to have more trouble with these games, but once I started um, playing with my ball sack, uh, it, I gradually got easier. I mean, it takes, it still, you know, it takes a lot of back and forth, a lot of practice, but. I probably should have been swapping between the different characters that I'm thinking that. I, I think I like this character, but there's uh, so the other characters. Uh, the blue one has a an, a bat, and one of them has a dragon, and then one of them something else. But I tend to always use this. I guess I guess I like the owl. be able to play as one of these pig fucking guys. When they release it on the Switch, I think they should add a character. And you should be able to be the fucking evil pig. Or maybe that frog. Or maybe that pile of shit right there. Like, what is, I, what is that even supposed to be? Like, literally, it's like a pile of mud, pile of shit. I think it's a pile of shit, literally. Pile of sh fucking shit right there. Thank you. Pig fucking guy DLC. Yes, pig fucking guy DLC. That's what it would be called as well. The PFG. The pig fucking guy. The PFG 9000. Fucking pig. Would you recommend we taint nunchucks? Um. If you get the original ones, they're good. They just don't get the later model. You would think the later model would be better, but it's, it's not, actually. I've, I've tried both. So, just word to the wise on that. If you, if you get it on eBay or something. 
You actually got this game early October, so it's a good game to play around Halloween, says Dan Evil Robot. I totally agree, Dan Evil Robot. This reminds you of an arcade game, says Baby Chicka. Well, believe it or not, <laughs> believe it or not, I'm walking on air. Never thought I could be so free. <laughs> what does the pro version look like? <laughs> Lying awake with a wing and a prayer. <laughs> this guy. Or whatever the fuck the lyrics are, I don't know. Fuck, really? So the continues may very well be turned off now. So when I die here, that might be it. But that's good. That's where that's the point I wanted to get to with this, to where it wasn't just, you know, credit feeding. But usually with, uh, with these games, I like to play them through a bit before I start doing that. Shit. God. All right, I have the other ability now, too. If I even get the chance to do it. Oh, I'm gonna fucking die. I'm doing it before I... Before I die. <laughs> We got bombs. I got two bombs, actually. That's about to run out. Oh, fuck. I didn't even get... Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, wait. There is continues? Wait, so what did... Wait a second. What? What did turning the EX off do, then? I thought that it was turning off the... See, I can't... Damn it. All right, well... Uh, then I have no idea what that did. I thought that that turned off continues. Apparently that's not what that is then. Does anybody actually know what the EX is then? ZPS says no, he does not know. Yeah, I have no idea. off your ex is called ghosting. 
Good, good one. Good one. You, I, I like it. Retro K, 1983. Sub tier one. Thank you very much for that. You don't know either. Uh, you know, Cape also put difficulty on the dip switch settings on the boards. Extra stages, you think? Oh, extra... S that's what it is? Extra stages? Well, was I doing extra... Because they were on before, so was I playing extra stages? If so, I did not know. I did not mean to hit that. God damn it. Well, now, so once again, it seems to have not made much of a fucking difference because it just keeps continuing. Which I didn't want. Let's actually do that. Um, I'm gonna quit. Um, so what I what I had been looking for was uh, a mode where it doesn't have yeah you know it only gives you one continue, which was not that. So apparently ex. I don't know if anybody can read that, but I'm gonna turn that back on since that has nothing to do with continues. Uh, as far as lives go, I mean, I could put it down. See, I see, I could put li you know, life on one. Um, oh, actually, wait a second. Would that be my actual uh, my life bar? That might be my life bar. I wonder. Let's actually say enemy damage. But, but I don't think there's anything here. Let me just say, well, if that's the actual like life bar, that would be hor horrifying. <laughs> here. I don't know if there's any way to change the continues. EX means some enemy shoots back bullets. Okay. That's what it is. Dark Fielder, that is correct. That, that is the one I have. Hey, Kid Crash, what's up? Um... Let's see if I have literally one life bar now. I think that's what that did. Let's see. Yeah, it is. Oh, now this is how you play Death Smiles. Now we're playing. Now, now, now we're talking. Now the only other thing is what about continues? There's no way to adjust the continues, I guess. Or maybe it is maybe it is limited to maybe I only get three or something, I don't know. Let's see how far I can get. Now we're talking now see, earlier in the stream we were playing on like easy and gradually like ramping things up. Look at look at where we're at now. <laughs> one one fucking energy bar. It's much better. I should just do nothing but play this game until I get through the fucking game with one <laughs> one bar of energy.
Come on, Mr. Owl. Mr. Owl, how many licks does it take to get to the Tootsie Roll center of a Tootsie Pop? The world may never know. Boom. Hey, there you go, that's level one. Oh, I almost forgot about this shit. <laughs> I'm a madman, I know. Reminds you, Castlevania. Sorry, I gotta get back to this. <laughs> it started. I looked over and there was a thousand bolts shooting out my face. Let's see about the continues. Like, I think they should be limited. Let's find out. Well, we'll we're definitely gonna find out if they are. Like, if they gave you three, I guess that would be fair, but I don't know. It just seems like they keep going and going and going. But we'll, we'll find out. TV just had the turtle in the hour. Never knew about the extended version that has the cow and the fox. Mr. Fox. <laughs> They're like, what? There was a cow and a fox in it too? What? <laughs> shoot faster but it's like it almost seems like it shoots as fast as it would just holding it down I'm a little confused by that like it, it seems to be shooting at max speed just holding it down anyway like I can't really tell the difference I was like, oh, like that's me tapping and that's holding it. Okay. Well, may maybe it is. Let's see. I'll tap it instead. This game just became Solar Surfer.
Mm. Man, man, it might be worth it. Might be worth it. I'll become a tappy tapper. I can do that too. The, the screen there at the end when it ends and like five different fucking screens all happen at the same time and it's just like, were those the story elements? I kind of like that because they're like, yeah, here's a bunch of screens and they're going to go by one frame each. Don't worry about what it says. Next next level, keep shooting. That I, I like that. I think that's great. It's almost like a joke. <laughs> It's like, somebody please explain that to me if it's not. It's just like, oh, you motherfuckers want story? Okay, here's your story. And you're, you're just gonna flash frame like eight things, eight frames by really quickly with totally different situations going on. So you're like, wait, I, this, I couldn't, what? And then it's over. And then you're back to shooting again. I think that's fucking fantastic. It's like it's like it's trolling you. It's the greatest thing I've ever fucking seen, actually. If I, uh, one day if I make a shmup, I never will. But if I ever did, I'm gonna steal that. And it's just it's just gonna be. You you want your story and your shmup? To like twenty like one frame things will go by, and it won't make any fucking sense. And you'll be like, wait, I don't know what is the story. I don't understand. It went by so quick. I don't get it. It's like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it did. I, I like that. That might be literally be my favorite story in, ever in any video game. That's my favorite one right there. You just saw it. It's basically like a big fuck you. My, the, the, one of the flash frames, Miles, will be like a big middle finger. It's like, oh, you wanted to read that? <laughs> Ah, uh, fuck you. That's what you get. This guy's fucked. You fucked, motherfucker. Come on. Come on. You know you want to die. You know you want to die. Mm, here, watch it. Here, 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 here it comes. It's going to come after this. My favorite part. Let's go. Let's see it. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> now, I, now I got to see what my chat says about that. Can you move faster when you tap? Uh, so when you're not shooting, uh, oh, I know, I see what you mean. But when you're not shooting, like you move faster than if you're just like holding it down the whole time. But earlier, what I was more doing was like I'd just hold it down. But then like if I need to get out of the way, I just totally release it to move. But I don't, I don't know. Dan Evil Robot says there's not much of a story in the game anyway. So who the hell cares? No, I know. That's why I, I like it. Sapphire Sapphire says good story would watch again tapping is the same speed as not shooting okay good advice apparently this is getting a re-release in Japan next year on Switch and PS4 yes I, I mentioned that earlier uh, that I forgot to mention though yeah so apparently they're gonna re-release it on Switch and PS4 but it's only gonna be Japan which happens a lot of times like for example I have another game here somewhere. I think I do. Yeah, like this one. So, uh, yeah, oh, this here. So, this one here is released, uh, uh, Ketsui, uh, Xbox 360. So let me see if I can, oh, this is not like set up for this right now. Here, uh, like that, right? But then they released it, uh, so, so that's Japan. Th but then they just re-released it on PS4, but Japan only, same game pretty much. I mean, there's differences, but but yeah. So like that's, you, you don't get that in the US. But the Japan only PS4 games work on the PS4, so. 
Oh, speaking of uh, the imports, I had streamed this before, but the Esperade game, that's on Switch as well. Here, I keep doing this. I gotta, I gotta fix this. But I've already streamed that one, if you guys remember that one. That's a Switch game. Again, though, Japan only. But it does work on American Switch because I played it, so I know. <laughs> the duck shirt, yeah. <laughs> Alright, um, let's keep going. I'm also looking forward to uh, Donald Duck Shooter. Hey, you had Maui Mallard. You had Going Quackers. Lucky Dime Caper. All these games. How about Where's the Schmuck? Come on, Donald. You had Cookie Monster Munch. Where's the Cookie Monster Schmuck? The one that's actually really surprising, though, and I mean, I'm joking around here, but the one that actually you would think that they would have done is a Mario one, like straight up. Now, I know, first thing people are going to say, what about Mario Land? Because there is a shmup section in that. But I mean a full game. It's actually weird to me that there was never a full Mario shmup, like, ever. Because they've done everything with Mario. There's a Mario typing game. Uh, there's like every fucking Mario game genre, you know, that you can think of. And they never they never did that. I, I, I think it's weird. Because Mario is such a, you know, obviously the biggest character ever, so. Oh, I wanted that apple. Where's my apple, Jax? Fucking tree. Mario real time strategy. <laughs> well, there's that um like Mario Rabbids game, which that game that game's actually cool. You're guaranteed. Hold up. You're guaranteed the big ass apples if you play on level three. If I play on level three. Well, what am I doing right now? I don't even know what I'm doing right now. On well, level, you mean like difficulty three? Because I think I'm higher than that now. I think I'm on four, actually. So I don't know what you mean by level three. I'm pretty sure my difficulty is higher than that. I'm playing on one? Well, my life bar, hold on, hold on a second. My life bar, I have. I only have one life bar, so that's what you mean by that? Oh, no, my life is, wait a second, no, 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 wait. My life is on one. The difficulty, from what I remember, I think is on four, isn't it? Now I don't, now I don't remember. That's what I thought it was on. Well, actually, wait, can I see from here? Maybe I can. Oh, I can't unless I exit it. Damn it. Know the screwy little menu. The screwy little menu? Wait, what? You are playing the stages on one. You have to select three manual. Are you, are you guys talking about on the map for the levels? Is that what you're talking about? Like the, like the overworld map? Oh, the map. See, they're all, see people are calling it the, the menu. So you're talking about the map. Okay, so let's call the map the map so there's less confusion. So, so when I'm on the map, I have to pick the third pathway and that's how I get the apple. Is that that's what it is? Yes, you can select the different ones on the map. Okay. Alright, so that's why I was confused. Alright. Oh fuck. Did I, wait no. Here. Let's hit the wrong thing. 
So when I'm on the map, basically, I'm picking the wrong thing that... So... See, I, now I just want to know about that. Now I don't even care. All I really care about is this fucking Apple thing now. <laughs> That's what I'm interested in now. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to try to figure this. I want to figure this out because I just want to know about the fucking Apple. I don't even care about any, anything else anymore. Um, so, my life's on one. Difficulty is on four, which is what I thought it was. And all that. So that's all fine. So we're going to get out of that. And then when we're in the game and we go to the map, let's see if I can find the right thing here. Because I'm trying to exactly understand it. So there's this, this, and... Oh, on the bottom. Oh! The bottom thing. I, I'm just seeing that now. Okay, that's... Now I see what you're saying. Like, that bottom part, that's what they meant. See, I didn't notice that. So what, uh... So what is the difference when you do that? Do that? Is that a different type of difficulty setting? I wonder if that's making the levels harder or like what. It seems like there's, it seems like it's going faster or something. I feel, yeah, I think there's gonna be more bullets and shit. Okay, so this is how you make the game harder, I think. Cause this seems like there's more shit coming at me, yeah. Okay. Here we go. I'm still alive, though. So hold up. Okay, now they're saying it's the highest difficulty. Select it five times and the enemies shoot bullets on death. Okay. Shit. Well, so wait, though. Um, I still have another question. I saw the apple before. Briefly, I saw that apple come out of that tree, right? So, if I have to be on the third difficulty to see the apple, how did I see the apple before since I wasn't on, I was on the first difficulty before. See what I'm saying? So how did I see the apple before if you have to be on the third setting? So, hang on. On level one, it still appears if you don't kill the boss fast enough. Okay. So, okay, here's the tray. That was good. I picked the right stage. So let's see if it comes up. So, so, so do I have to kill this guy really fucking fast to see this apple? I'm on, I'm on the. Oh, oh, there's the fucking apple. Oh, I've seen a bunch of apples now. Oh, so we're. Oh, look at all the apples. So that's just for the apples, though. Is the game in general have a lot of different things if you're playing through on the different difficulty settings? Now I want to see the other stage. Look at all these fucking apples now. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Now we're talking. This is cool. I'm Dodgy McGee over here, too. Boom. All right. Is this a cute em up? Ah. Uh... Find it as that. Man, I don't, I, don't, I don't know. Maybe elements. Like, look, the, the owl looks kind of cartoony. I guess, sort of, kind of, but not really. I don't know. It's sort of a in-between kind of thing. Like some of the shit in here is grotesque. So, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if that's the way to define it. Like that fucking face is like nasty. You know. <laughs> Shit, they're fucking me up now. Yeah, this is way harder now. Yeah, 
You like how I'm still doing one fucking health bar? <laughs> I should like really. What I should be doing probably is, is three health bar, I guess. And uh, I mean, I guess you can do anything you want. Three health bar, but put it on level three. Like this, this is the difficulty level I think I want to be on. It's just weird, I didn't know you had to select it like on the map part. At least on the second one, you know? Like this guy, like that, that thing right there, that fucking face is anything but a fucking cute him up, if you ask me. Like that thing's fucked up. Look, now he turns into a skull. That uh, and those hearts and shit. That see, that's new. Never saw that before. Oh shit! Now we just like it's like unlocking a new game almost. Look at that. That's so cool that there's. I wonder like if there's differences between each. If like level level two gives you a little more and then level three gives you the most kind of all the bosses have an extra phase on level three okay level two is much more similar to one than three okay but there's some differences though This is so much better now, by the way, I'm not like this. Well, I'm glad you guys alerted me to the third, to the, the settings on the map screen. Because that makes all the difference in the world. Here's my Mr. Pumpkin jack-o'-lantern. Mr. Owl. Boom. Oh, look at that, see? Yeah, so that, that's different too. Whoa. It's kind of acts as a shield, I guess, a little bit. That's cool. Oh, it's like the third phase, huh? Oh, yeah, look, look at that. Wow. Shit. That is cool. So much better. <laughs> Breathe that uh, whole uh, sort of fresh new life into it for me. Um, and also, you know what? Like, I'm glad that I played through it first on like the easier stuff, so that we could find out about 
this, you know? And I do think it's largely uh, helpful here to be tapping more, honestly. Now, now I'm finding myself tapping more. I think I think I can kill shit quicker, actually. I don't really want to be tapping, <laughs> but... Scenes. Mr. Owl, how many shots does it take to rip the flesh off a giant face in the ground? Oh my god. That's a whole different commercial. Am I playing with the 360 D-pad? So, I talked about that earlier, if you're just coming in, Matt Kuo. Uh, so, I have this one, because we know that three, the D-pad on the 360 is assy. Um... I have this one I'm playing with right now, which I, I like this controller. At least, at least I, I like it at the moment. So, I mean my balls. I meant to say. Sorry, I meant to say my balls. This is like a totally different boss fight. Nuts. This is nuts. This is totally nuts now. Didn't I have another bomb? Come on. Damn. Wah! some sections but don't rely on it yeah yeah it's like you know this, this is my first time really like playing this game in depth at all i've tried this game before but i haven't really uh played it for very long so this is by far the longest i've ever played this game um like before before today i, I think i tried the first stage or two i never like went through and looked at the whole game before um So I'm getting the hang of it, basically. Slowly. Ah, motherfuck.
is my man. Let's see, I want to see what he does different. Throw fucking sandwiches at me. That's what I want to see happen. <laughs> I want him to throw, like, sub sandwiches. Fucking, uh, gyro. Gyro, or whatever, however you want to pronounce it. Come on, do different shit. I mean, it's kind of is with these blocks. I wish the blocks were sandwiches. That's my that's my critique of Death Smiles. I, I think those board cubes should be uh, sausage sandwiches. Fucker, still alive. Oh, come on. All right, well. <laughs> this is my favorite. He's my favorite guy. The Borg have a new ally, the great space cow. Yes. Coming in, M. Pava. I'm gonna get fucked up on this stage. Oh my god. Oh, I just. I went to use the bomb. I'm too late. Shit like that. Oh my god, look at that. Look at that ice. Is that an ice cream? The fuck? One ups are ice cream? I've never seen that before. That's pretty awesome. There goes all my fucking lives. Bombs, I mean. I can't even speak. Shit. Oh my god. This is insane. Yeah, bro, I didn't even use any bombs there. Fucking this up so bad. I mean, is that like lava coming down? Oh, I guess you can't be there. You gotta be like, uh, uh, hold up. I'm trying to figure this out. I guess on that area, the lava was like coming up and you gotta like be above the platforms to not get hit by the lava. Shit. I don't think the earlier one on the easier settings, I don't think that was like that. I think that's different. I think that is another difference. We just made a fucking diarrhea wall. Come on now. Come on. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the fuck? 
I've never seen that yet. Look how different this is. Wow. Lots of lots of different things up there on that uh, setting. That's cool. It's a better game like this. Welcome to the pain train. Was that the train level I was on? The pain train. All right, let's see. Let's see the differences here. It's gonna get destroyed here. Death two. Okay. Feels like when the game really begins. Yeah, fuck it, Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh my god. I guess I, I should probably be tapping more so I can move around these bullets faster. Or, or not, I don't know. Is there enough going on? I'm just trying to see what the rest of it is. I just want to see the differences.
God. <laughs> My God. <laughs> Every time, never remember this shit. I don't know why. I like this part. I just always forget that it's gonna happen. Oh. I didn't even mean to hit that. Definitely gone to above my skill level now. Jesus, all right, let's at least just see what this fucking guy does differently. It'll be interesting to see. This looks like a nice, relaxing, non-stressful game, says Harry Kidney. Yeah, it's n there's no stress whatsoever. Oh my god. This die. Hitboxes, yeah, it was a little dot, yeah. Alright, let's see this. This is the part I've been wanting to say. He didn't do the extra phase? I don't know. Never seen it on the setting, so I wouldn't know the difference in it. Was there supposed to be something else? Oh, he wasn't shooting shit like this before either. Oh my god. This fucking part, I don't know, man. I 
bombs too tonight. Shit, man. I don't even know why I'm bothering. I should just fucking use the bombs and get it over with. Come on, motherfucker. There we go. Alright, it's like halfway. Now what? Now what, motherfucker? Like, this shit is like, what the fuck? God. I still don't understand, like, if it's, uh... I didn't even bother to use the bombs. I still don't understand if this part is like you're supposed to just hit the hands, or um, am I supposed to be like trying to get up higher to hit the heart piece? Like I don't even know, you know. So that's something I like have to like learn. I don't know, like really understand that. Oh yeah, now this part. I forgot about this part. Yeah, that part with the hands, like, I have no idea. I don't really understand it. It's probably a terrible time to use that. Demon come, demon come. Watch out for that demon come. All right, well, definitely a lot more bullets on that mode. I don't know. So there was a whole another section. Somebody was saying there was a whole another section that like didn't even come up. It was the opposite of Super Mac Death Christ. Hey, Andy Mobile. Final boss of Death Miles 2 is Satan Claws. <laughs> Evil Santa, that would be cool. Well, I'll do uh, that sometime. I have it. There's a bonus stage you didn't get to do, but it's ridiculously hard. So for the bonus stage, you basically have to memorize the whole thing to even stand a chance, right? You like, do you know how you even get to it though? There's obviously, I probably have a higher score or something. Or probably much higher. Pick, I don't even know. You pick a different story ending or something. Not that I can read it, right? Bonus stage is left of the final stage. Oh, did I pick the wrong thing on the map, maybe? So there she was with the owl, and that's the other one with the bat. I was talking about. So, okay. Well, that's cool. Um, obviously, these games, you know, require a ton of practice to get to get good, brah. But uh, definitely, that was definitely fun. And then, so then the other part of it is um, this. So then there's all this too. Different. There's like arcade version 1.1. Uh, the, the one I was just doing was this was the 360 version so like the version 1.1 I don't know uh, like what the differences are
the Steam version has two bonus stages. And bosses. Okay. So, like, with the version I have, like, I don't know, like, what I get or whatever. So, I don't know. Anyway, that, that's, that's about it. Um, yeah, so, down there, that was the important thing to learn. If you want to do the harder settings, on the map screen here, you gotta drop down to three. And then, uh... That's how you do that. But anyway, all right. So that's that's enough de death smiles for now. Um, so I have death smiles too. Uh, we can check out sometime. Here's death smiles too, which is Christmas themed. I'll show you guys that. Here's death smiles too. Maybe someday we'll try that one. Also have uh, uh, that pork, the pork one, mushy pork. Uh, all, all kinds of different ones. It's on and on and on. Um, oh, we got, and then on PlayStation 2 as well. But I have to hook up the uh, my Japanese PlayStation for that. So, on and on and on with the shooters. All right, guys. Anyway, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. I like the Halloween theme of that game. Um, all the pumpkins and scythes and skeletons and all that stuff. But anyway, all right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you later. Bye.